earning up to $150,000 a year from a rental side business. Yes. With this nice, gentleman nice you know, was in the military. He was in the military. He served his country. He saved his money. Okay. And, you know, thank you for your service, sir. Um, then, you know, while he was in the military, he saved his money and he liked buying toys like, you know, a boat and a ski, jet ski, couple of cars, right? So then he quit the military. He was done. He retired. And then now he goes, well, you know, I have all these toys. I can't drive them all, all at the same time. What do I do with these things? He says, well, now he's renting them all out and he's creating himself a hundred and fifty thousand dollar year you know he has a tesla as well he just bought one with the money that he earned he, he just keeps buying new stuff right and he keeps renting it out he's like the airbnb you know people buy condos and rent them out and this guy is doing it with all his toys jet skis motorcycles um, cars um whatever comes to mind on a moving vehicle this guy is renting him out and uh there you go he's making himself 150k a year so that was his side hustle. He worked hard. Obviously, he risked his life for his country, but now he's getting rewarded. All kudos to you, sir. And, you know, again, our goal is to inform and educate. This is this, 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 this ride share thing or the delivery thing. It's wonderful when it's wonderful. Okay. However, you have to have a plan B. This guy risked his life probably for 20 years, did God knows how many tours in Iraq and Afghanistan came back all his pieces together and now he's enjoying his life with his side hustle and he had a plan b he goes if i don't get killed in afghanistan or iraq i'm gonna rent my freaking toys and make money well your goal should be the same you know if i just save my money and then work for a plan b that's why the gig economy is good for again gig economy is great for people with a plan b or for a bigger you know uh, is this is this is not a full-time gig i mean i seriously drove for like three days to take those recordings i honestly wanted to drive i wanted to do trips and i saw that and i'm like i can't do this it's giving me anxiety i just can't there was maybe two trips doable out of those 25 things i got bro i mean come on man i'm like come on so that's it please people pay attention to your side hustle save your money work for your towards your plan b whatever it is doesn't have to be this, but we give you ideas every week. And, and you know, gig economy is wonderful for the sort of certain people with the flexibility and the freedom it offers. But also think of your future. It's not something that you can do it for years and years and now. Yeah. How long? I mean, that's the thing. How long do you do you think driving rideshare food delivery is going to last? So, you know, if you want that freedom and flexibility, you know, hustle, do a little hustle. What's your what's your passion? What do you you think about? And, you know, this This is, again, like the reason why that we want to highlight these different ones is for inspiration. And if you're inspired to think of an idea that's similar to this or even something like this or any of the other side hustles that we've mentioned in the past several weeks, um, it's just something where you can say, hey, this, this is my idea. And, you know, you get that fire going and you start up uh, and you work towards it and you know, that's the, the, the true fleet freedom and flexibility when that thing starts taking over, if you can yep. get it to that, that level. Um, and then, yeah, well. you know, driving rideshare and food delivery and that that's great for the supplemental time, uh, in between and the ability for the freedom and flexibility is great because if you have to do certain meetings at certain times, or if you got to do something else at other times, you know, you can squeeze it in when you can. So you can still pay the bills, but still follow your dream. All right. Thanks for watching. That short little clip was from our live stream, Show Me the Money Club with Sergio and myself. Tuesdays, 6 p.m. Eastern, 3 p.m. Pacific. Make sure you subscribe, turn on all notifications so you'll be notified when we go live, as well as all of our awesome content. Make sure to check out this video right here, which will take you to the entire live stream, or check out this video right there. All right. Drive smart, everyone.